चंडीगढ़ में थे perfect if i'm audible and visible welcome to another stream everyone so if i'm perfectly audible and visible can i see a hi from each and everyone okay hi there you from bilai okay we'll, we'll catch up soon in that case for sure uh hey ritesh ritesh is like a star attending each and every event each and every mlh are talking about ritesh attending events hi ritesh okay hi h1 H1 Poke, hello. Hi, 404 not found. Thanks for telling me I'm visible. Okay, okay, I, I, I need more highs in the chat, guys. I need more highs in the chat. We have a lot of people joining today. Uh, so, I guess we'll wait for everyone to join. So, before, before we actually start, I'd like to ask you all people, like from the place you're joining, like, I think, now how how is the voice is it audible properly or oh, there are some some issues again perfect great 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 okay so before we start on just okay much better i'm i'm really sorry like i have i'm at a different place currently so i have to deal with the internet issues i'm really sorry for everyone if you like face any type of problem so once again we start and uh, like drop in the place you are hacking currently this weekend or attending this session i want to know like more and more people are joining in so like as thorik said he's from bilai and <laughs> you you can hack again hey said that okay india okay you can drop if you are like from india you can also drop the specific city uh okay anyone else okay hey hey kanish kav i hope i am i have taken your name right if, if that's not a problem okay okay you you are from the south side ritesh okay great like i didn't have an idea i saw you in the ritvish stream on that day but still okay abhigyan is from odisha hey abhigyan okay rpj09 okay what's your full name rpj you are hacking from delhi i guess we are uh, around the same area um i guess more and more folks are joining okay so my video is paused are you sure uh, is it fine guys okay great 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 if you any fee, if you ever feel any type of technical difficulties let me know in the chat i'll try to switch my network once again really sorry for the network issues i'm at a place like i do not have a control over internet so okay okay thank you so much ritesh so we'll start with today's session like what is a kanban board so starting with you guys what do you think what is a kanban board basically i'll go with my definition i'll i'll actually share my definition i have worked on to tell you 
guys like what is it is but when you heard it for the first time like if you have heard it for the first time ever in your life a kanban board what do you think it is like let me know in the chat i know you are there for yep yes i guess a lot of people know why i am delhi okay something related to productivity okay I, i'll so tell you head start how we're going to make this kanban board but yep kind of a board like trello okay to be very accurate uh, 404 not more uh, yes rpg i'm in for hack on to but there are other activities also first time hearing it japanese technique for productivity okay ritesh is more like a google answer but obviously you have searched for it thank you so much okay yes when we talk about kanban boards it's related to your productivity so for example i guess each and every one of you know right now like uh what how we make a website right do everyone have a idea like i would like to explain you through that example like what is like a website how it works how kanban board will actually help you increase the productivity can i get a yes in the chat like a website simple website using html css there have been a lot of sessions uh, during this global hack week for the front end okay i'm getting a lot of yes okay that's that's great so when we talk about uh, websites primarily there are three main domains right we talk about front end we talk, uh, talk about back end and we talk about ui ux so we have different teams for all the other things but when these teams actually work with each other like they have a set of things like the dead deadlines assigned to them or they are, or they also like prepare a set of things like they do uh, they want to do for example i'll give the example of ritesh here right so he's been so active and so is abhigyan and other R, uh, rpg and other people during this mlh weeks you uh, you guys attend sessions right so when you actually sign up for a event or check in for a event it's like added to your calendar so that whenever you want to attend that particular session you will get a notification or you have something in your calendar things are like marked particularly what are the things you wanted to attend like how it will be beneficial for you how it will increase your productivity because for example if i am someone who wanted to work around front end and wanted to learn more technologies i will be attending sessions around front end and other things so that is how the role of kanban board came into play so kanban board for example we are working in a team of 10 we will be making a kanban board so i'll like to like I, we have currently 21 hackers joining and more hackers joining in so i'll request you all the time i'll start making a kanban board we will do that for sure but i am just trying to clear the basics like what a kanban board actually does for you so for example if i have to say we are a team of 10 people and i am a front end developer my friend uh, siddharth is a back end developer and we have also a ui ux developer so everyone contributes uh, on a daily basis on different levels i will be like creating the landing page for the event the back end team will be like uh, creating the Uh, set, uh, the firebase to actually accept data and store it and the ui ux team would be act, uh, can be like taking data from the people how website can be good so when we talk about kanban boards it's a simple way to actually put things into uh, like a remark so if i can give you an example of a kanban board just give me an ex- uh, a second guys hmm okay when we talk about kanban boards i guess my screen is not visible for now hmm okay i guess now it will be visible share share screen chrome tab share i guess my uh, screen is now clearly visible can i get a high in the chat for if the things are going right okay great i'm so sorry guys i am a bit nervous too because this is my like a first website where i'm actually like focusing like working along for the single time okay it's visible that's great okay 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 so when we talk about kanban boards it's like structuring things in a proper way for example when we three people are working on a three do- uh, three different domains for example if someone from the ui ux team updated that we are working on this like they are working for the user experience part or they are taking updates from the people like how uh, people actually want the, uh, an e-commerce website to be so like they will put that thing in the working part now when we talk about like here it is divided into ready to start working waiting and review for example when we talk about making an e-commerce website or or even a simple website we can focus on like the things which have been like in the backlog then we can uh, move towards design 
the things we need to plan for the daily activities, the to-do list, the doing, making in code review. So code review is also one of the most important part, like when we are building something, uh, when we go through uh, certain instances, we need to review our code that what are the redundancies we can actually remove from the code? What are the things which is going to make your code simpler, neater and other things? Then we talk about testing and then yes, these are all the things which actually goes around while making a website and we'll be focusing on each and everything. So I'll request all of you to like, you can go to Trello, you can go to GitHub, you can go to each and every uh, everywhere and you can like just write the Kanban board. So I'll my share my other screen. I'll also show like what an Kanban board actually does for a like a simple website. Uh, just give me a second. I'll stop sharing this. Okay. I guess this will make picture more clear. Okay. So this is a basic, which I actually designed for all of you people to understand, like how, what are the things we can actually play do like before making a website. So, uh, you might have like many, if, if you're in colleges or something, you might have a subject called project management or SEPM, Software Engineering and Product Management, Project Management. So the thing is every semester, like in, in your six or semester, seven semesters, you are like given a task to make a website or, hey, Sushmita, thanks for joining. So like uh, when you're in your sixth, seventh or eighth semester, you have been given, you aren't late, we have just started. We are focusing on like how uh, you didn't miss anything. Don't worry, we have just started like why Kanban board is important. Uh, I'll definitely, uh, H14K, the notion has same task template similar to this, but there are some different factors, which we like, even I will say, when we talk about task template or something like that, you can actually browse through each and every, uh, different platforms. I have said, you can go through Trello. You can also go through GitHub. GitHub also has a good Kanban board. You can go through, like you uh, mentioned notion. It's all about what other ways you can actually put the things in a right way. The session will be also focusing on that, like what are the things you can actually put up, why it is required and why should you adopt Kanban board strategies in your day to day life, like when you're working on a project or something like that. So I guess uh, that will solve your doubt. So talking about next thing, like uh, we are focusing on an e-commerce website. So I have designed, used a simple template uh, with the help of a trilo. So the things which is covering is the backlog design to do doing code review testing and done so uh, i'll ask you guys what we can fill in this according to you and then we can actually move forward the reason is you need to think uh, like think of uh, think of like you're like a team lead a team lead who is leading a, P a team of like 10 to 20 people they are working in different domains it can be like some are divided into the front end some are divided into the back end and some are into the ui ux so let's start let's divide it into four different stages the first stage is planning. Planning will include uh, like talking to people, getting the research, like what people actually want to see into a website and we'll start putting up it here. So more than backlog, we can actually uh, write it as a planning thing. Okay. Um, open card. You can cover a thing that is as a planning pack. So what are the things do you think like we can actually add up in a planning thing? Like I can, I can tell that uh, I have made website like for using APIs and all, and I've planned this thing, but according to you, when we are like designing a website, what are the things we should be there in the planning sector usually? So I want to get your, or, and even not talking about only about the websites, we can also work along the different things such as like, if you have worked in an Android project, what are the things you actually go through into the planning sections? So just write it down into the comments, like what all goes when you actually think of making a website. Basic overview of how a website should look like a blueprint. Okay. So we can like blueprint, add cart. Okay. What are the other things you can actually work upon? Different other things. We have more, we have more hackers, I guess I, we need more things like I can do this thing alone, but the major thing I wanted to do this with you guys is to actually understand, like make things simpler, like how we can actually optimize ourselves using the Kanban board. The Kanban board 
is something like each and everyone can go to Google search. You can have a template. You can work. Okay. Core idea value that your product is trying to communicate. Okay. I guess that might have been added to the next part, but still. Core idea. Okay. We have got two things for. Okay. Most important thing. Deciding the tech stack beforehand. That's. Okay, Sushmita De, how can uh, I make a CAN board? Also, what is a CAN board thing? So I'll just repeat for Sushmita De once again. So when we talk about, like, let's start with CAN board, uh, Kanban board. Okay, uh, I, I didn't show you guys like how we can make one, right? Okay, we can do this right now. Just give me a second. That's my bad. Hmm. Share screen, Chrome tab. Hmm, I don't know why I'm not able to see. Okay, no, no it's good. Okay, is my, uh, okay, it's visible, it's visible. So for example, uh, I'm using Trello for creating the Kanban board. I'll just pin the link here too. I want you guys to actually do this with me. So it would be a great thing to actually cover up. We will also like at the end share a common Trello link. Like where when we'll like put all the things all together, like for building a website, what are the things? So I'll ask you guys to like go into Trello. Uh, once you log in, just uh, write and high in the chat. We'll go with you guys. Just write a high in the chat once you are at Trello.com. Actually, I want all the hackers like present in the stream to actually do this with me. The main thing is I will be actually putting out all the things like what is more important into like things like in the Kanban board while making a website. But I know everyone is not interested into web development. One, you can be actually thinking about making a daily life schedule into Kanban board or it can be making an Android project. Okay, I've got two highs. Come on, guys, we can uh, increase that number for sure. Okay, you have to just write trello.com. You can also copy and paste. Okay, I'll go ahead. I guess in that case, if people are shy, writing hi in the chat. Okay, logged in. Great. I'll just proceed. So what you can do is you can like create here. You can create a board or if you want to start with a template. So now though, if when you when we talk about starting from a template, it's a pretty easy thing because all the things will be automatically sorted. And when you log in into Trello, you can see all these different boards. So when we talk about four different things here, okay, uh, I guess everyone, okay, Ritesh is logged in, H14K is logged in, Abhigyan is logged in, RPJ is logged in. Uh, Sushmita, uh, did you log? Did you log into Trello? I'll I'll definitely ask all the guys like hackers present in the stream to do it because the things I'll put in my uh, like the Kanban board. Okay, I'll, I'm waiting for you. Don't worry, I'm waiting for you. The main thing I want. Uh, from this activity is our thoughts are totally different and I want you guys to actually put out the unique things create your account we'll wait for two three minutes don't worry I want you guys to actually put out new thoughts it's okay Shushmita we'll, we are waiting so I want you guys to actually put out new thoughts how you can actually make those websites scanman boards more efficient than actually even more the people who are working in a company and you won't believe in this like when we when you actually move into a professional career things like Kanban boards will be like in your day-to-day -day life because when we work in an organization or a team of like 10 to 20 people they are like more focused on this like let's create a particular overview okay Akasha has also done that like let's create an overview of the things we will do in a particular day I guess that's a not a new thing like when we were uh, like small during our A circle our parents was like used to say this like you need to make a daily schedule of what you will be doing i guess this might be done by each and every individual which is present over here when we when the time around exams were used to happen the thing we wanted or we all do is like we create a timetable right we create a timetable we will give three hours to math two hours to science it helps making the communication more fluid i guess i guess more of a perfect definition H14K. Uh, yes, you can proceed with a, a Kanban tablet. So I guess each and every individual currently is now fit with it. 
I guess more hackers uh, have already logged in. They're like, just shy. So you can use, like, you can see four different type of templates. When we talk about the most popular templates, as I said, when you move into an organization, uh, like people are like focusing more on such things specifically because they want a daily structure a particular intern or a particular full-time employee will follow. Kanban boards would be super useful during exams or if only we knew. To be very honest, Ritesh, uh, during this online era, like we have grown so much. We were used to write things on paper, right? We were used to make a timetable. We used to like stick it to our, uh, uh, like the study table, right? So since that, uh, the online era came, then we moved to laptops, phones, all we want is like a particular structure and specifically via Kanban board, because currently we all are focusing towards remote jobs, right? People are sitting at their homes. I'm at Delhi. Uh, this Delhi is not my home. I'm at Delhi. I'm giving a session. It's like a remote work, right? But we want a singular place for each and everyone to actually go and contribute to it. So for example, if two di different developers are like sitting in different domains of the country, so they will be confused like what he or she is doing. Yes, I use pen, paper and whiteboard during exams. You're not alone, h one k We have all have done that during our exams. And sometimes like the motivation we were used to get, if you like remember guys, the motivation uh, you actually get by like during those things, right? Uh, writing those things. Like I'll wake up at 6 a.m. in the morning or I'll just like, uh, I'll study eight to 10 minutes, then I'll take a 15 minute break or 20 minute break. Then I'll study two hours of science. Then I'll have my food, I'll sleep. Then I'll go to play. Then I'll come back and again study. So this was the thing which is like shifted from that pen paper circuit to an online digital era. So that each and every person, like even from the different areas can actually like work. Which app can I use to make the Kanban board? Again, uh, your K Victoria. Uh, you can use Trello, you can use GitHub. I'm using Trello. Uh, the template is already available so that it would be easy for you to actually start with it. And it's a, uh, if like, yes, as RPG said, you can actually go with Trello. That would be actually great. Okay, before before we start this, I actually also wanted to do uh, a diff uh, one more activity. So just give me a second. I have actually planned this activity, I just forgot. We should do this before we actually move on to the Kanban boards. Okay, making. Okay. So, uh, just a second. I will stop sharing the screen. I as I guess everyone is logged in, but this activity is also great which you are going to do right now. Just a second. Share my screen. Great. Okay. So since we have talked about timetables and all other sort, let's focus towards what are the things we actually do while making a timetable. So can you list down the things? I have told a lot already, but can you actually, uh, I'll also increase the font size for sure. Okay, just list down the things you actually have done uh, way back, like while making a timetable for the school or like not sticking to the timetable. We can actually do one thing to be very specific. Uh, for example, your internet connection is broken. Okay, so this is a new thing we have talked about exam. Right, internet connection is not working properly. So we'll, uh, I will, I'll use like one volunteer from the chat. Uh, let's use Ritesh. Okay, Ritesh, uh, if you're available in the chat, just say a hi to me in a quick sense. We'll use you here. Then we will move to the Kanban board activity. Uh, Ritesh is in the chat. Okay, let's go, Ritesh. Okay, Ritesh, we'll create a hypo scene like you have uh, internet service provider and you have like the internet connection is not working from the like last two to three days. So what are the things you will actually do in an order? Just tell me what are the things you will do? You will call someone or what you will do on your personal own things. For example, your internet is like not working from the last two, two to three days. You are totally frustrated. You have certain things in mind you can do, but let's try to stick it in a particular order. Like 
go with total flow it should not be a particular thing uh, like in a particular set but you can go through whatever thing uh, whatever comes to your mind like when your internet connection is not working okay you'll call the isp okay then first i would have to call up the isp okay okay we are waiting for the next one i know it it sounds pretty difficult like in the middle of the stream if someone tells you just go just do it and you be actually stuck up at it but yes it's an activity which like you have been part of uh, i'll ask for the hotspot until the service is not provided okay that's a valid answer not gonna lie i have done this like when my service provider is not there i'm asking my colleagues or my brother for like the hotspot kind of thing because i usually drain up all my data during midnight okay the customer care service then there would be multiple rounds up of following that okay okay what we can go next i would try to troubleshoot first okay great okay uh, although ritesh is doing this activity i'm loving the enthusiasm for of our other people too i'm also adding others people answer and this is a great way to actually understand how kanban board would actually work okay we'll also write this thing just give me a second i'll troubleshoot first okay okay what are what are the other things you guys think i'll appreciate all the more more answers i guess we have more and more hackers joining in so guys uh, if you don't have the like what we are doing is we are just asking ritesh like his internet service provider is is actually not able to give him a good internet and he is totally fed up of him so what he will do okay submit the feedback report to isp nice okay i'll also show the comments the thing when i am taking in feedback submit okay, what's next we have to fix an appointment with the isp nice the isp okay 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 next 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 usually there would be instructions by them over the phone but if the problem there is for a couple of days we would be expecting a technician okay okay uh, like you would be expecting a technician right you would be calling a technician moreover like if they do not show up you will be calling a personal technician right my uh, grammarly will help me here okay do we have more points i guess people have already covered it at all like the activity which you are doing here will actually help you guys to actually understand what kanban board is okay pre download bunch of useful <laughs> content to consume again a good answer okay download content to consume okay. next 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 great answers for it okay we would have to take care of the time at which they are right giving instructions to okay great to okay uh okay i have got literally very good answers like you can all see in the document i'll try to i'll ask you guys to actually fit it up in a sequence so uh, i'll take two to three more if you have thing uh, guys uh, for all the new hackers which are joining to the stream uh, we have simple we have a simple problem statement ritesh internet service provider is actually uh, not uh, like not liking him and is tampering his internet connection time to time so uh, we are asking ritesh what would be the different things he would do to get his internet back or uh, make him feel happy because you know when the internet is not available to us we actually think of the things like what we can do because our life is actually surrounded by internet i'll take two to three more quick suggestions and then we can do thing i'll just check the comments did this i hope your internet gets fixed now totally we will we'll also add this thing internet
ओके स्विचिंग आई एस पी ओके आई गेस आई गॉट द टू रिमेनिंग आंसर विच आई वॉज एक्चुअली लुकिंग फॉर ओके आई गेस वी हैव मल्टीपल एंड मल्टीपल कैन वी गो विथ ओके नो दिस इज नॉट अ गुड थिंग अगेन जस्ट गिव मे अ सेकेंड ओके गाइस दिस इज द प्रॉब्लम स्टेटमेंट दिस इज लाइक दिस इज नंबर वन नंबर टू नंबर थ्री नंबर फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट लाइक दैट ओके सो टोटल ऑफ नाइन टेक्स नाइन टास्क आर नाउ असाइंड सो वी हैव डन दिस थिंग इन द स्कूल वी आर गोन डू दिस थिंग अगेन वर्स्ट केस सीनरी ऑफ दफ इट्स अ नेचुरल कम्युनिटी ट्राई टू कीप काम ओके विल ऑल्सो एट दिस uh hmm now it's next perfect okay as h14k said we have nine tasks so what you have done this you might have learned uh, like heard the word jumbled sentences right we have done this activity back then at school like if we are giving competitive example exams of like english you might be seeing them again treat them as these numbers number 1 number 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 total are 10 tasks okay try to arrange them in a order which will make them a perf- perfect sequence like what to do if the internet connection is not working properly and then we will switch to the kanban board thing explaining that how it actually works you can take 5 minutes just write the number sequence what would be the num- perfect number sequence take care of all the points which are like being mentioned by each and every one and then we can focus on it believe me guys this is an activity will, which will actually train your brain to actually think that how i can actually plan different things according to if my internet connection is not available i'll give you guys time till like it's 11 1 ist we'll, we can wait till 11 6 ist i'll just go and grab uh, water in in that scene just give me 5 uh, minutes you have 5 minutes to do it okay
Okay, hey, 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 I'm back. I'm really sorry. I was like just getting a water break and I just got that. Uh, I guess Ritesh is already ready with the with the answers. I'll just fix it, uh, take it over to the stream. Okay, first we'll troubleshoot, second call the ISP, third report. Uh, okay, call the ISP and report the second. Switch to hotspot and download content to consume. Okay, the next one. Okay, multiple rounds of following up. Okay, getting the technician if else scenario. Okay, the next thing would be uh, getting the internet fixed, change the ISP, great. And then key and keeping calm should be in progress throughout the process. Okay, uh, we'll give uh, plus five points to Ritesh for that, for sure. Okay, we'll go to H14K. Okay, starting with 10, keep your calm. Perfect, start, perfect way to start. Then uh, we'll you will troubleshoot first. Then we can go to downloading content to consume okay then you'll call the isp okay uh, then you'll submit the feedback right then you will go with the multiple rounds up upon following that that's great then it would be fix an appointment with the isp calling the personal technician switching isp and getting internet fixed okay of course a great answer now we can focus towards rpg09 answer starting with the third you will troubleshoot first, you will call the ISP, you will go for multiple rounds upon up, up following that. Okay, I'll, I'll be very serious, like uh, dealing with uh, the ISPs is a very tough thing to do, especially for the multiple rounds thing when we talk about. The next thing would be fixing an appointment with the ISP. It's, it's not like an appointment, but still, yes. Then it would be calling the personal technician, keeping her calm, okay. Uh, then it would be downloading content to consume and internet getting fixed. Okay. Okay. The four is the last one, right? RPJ feedback summit at the last. Okay. So we'll just like to, I would like to, first of all, thank you for actually taking your time to actually do this activity. We can actually see like, if you can measure in all the different three things. Okay. We have also an answer from us to uh, keep your calm troubleshoot multiple round call the isp switch isp internet getting fixed okay we also have the answer from shushmita day starting with 10 3 uh, okay keep your calm troubleshoot first call the isp feedback summit appointment then we have download content to consume uh calling personal technician okay then we have okay and then the second one is multiple rounds up following that okay so the basic thing before this activity was actually to understand that each and every person thinks differently when we talk about things. So for here example, when we talk about uh, Ritesh, then we have H14K, RPJ, Astitva, Sushmita Day. The thing you can actually mention, you guys can actually see that each and every one of you think differently. Although you wanted to like have the same output at the end, but the initial process was different. Okay, we also have an answer from your k victoria we have a like we'll keep our calm we'll troubleshoot first call the isp okay the thing is many people are starting with 10 but still you can actually like observe this process that when 10 different people are working on the same company currently all the people in all the hackers which are present in the chat were given a single statement like the problem statement all of them came up with the answers some actually started with same type of consistency same type of like the things we should do at start some started differently but like you had the same problem statement but the solutions were different so this was the main reason kanban board were actually introduced into the market so now we can actually go and focus towards the kanban board thing like you might have now understand the basic thing like why like i guess all the people here in the chat are already smart they already know what kanban board is but also thanks by thank you for sticking by the uh, small experiment we did okay i'll just uh, share my kanban board screen Just give me a second. Uh, okay, great. Uh, okay, again, when we uh, talk about different type of templates, project management, Kanban template, simple project board, remote team hub, we'll just, like I guess uh, I already had, we need everyone on board with one workload. Perfect definition, Ritesh. Like 
each i guess already many people have said that but yes this is the main thing why kanban board were actually introduced people different in different domains can actually have a similar walk through of like what they actually want to contribute with because when we work in teams we have a single agenda we like if we want to make a e e-commerce website all the people of this company know that we need to make this e-commerce website what would be the things we would be doing on the daily basis it's the thing <laughs> thanks thanks rpj okay we'll shift to the boards one i guess each and every one of you logged on to the trello one we'll like just go to the canvan tab directly okay i guess we have already done it uh it's a basic canvan tablet which we actually uses like for the project and other thing again it's totally editable now uh i as the same activity we have done like i want you guys to actually log on to the trello thing and take a project you have actually made it can be it can also be a science project you made it during your like the 10th class or the 11th class and fill up this board you can even i guess as i have said like it's totally editable and i'll uh, do the same thing for like making a crypto website i made like in the recent time uh okay all the aspiring to publish the phoenix project it revolves a lot around this strategy i guess i can totally relate to ritesh i had a, a like thing around this phoenix project because i like when i was making a, my project alone singular in a team i actually realized why it is so much important to work in a team sort things like this like work together for that so that a total workload is not uh, like totally dependent upon you but also not on the team so when you are working in a team you have those things like the things are particularly divided if you have a per perfect workflow believe me some projects don't even take more than a week to complete but if such structures are not made it can actually take you months to actually complete a simple project so in that case i guess many people have actually logged into trello as i have said i have like giving i am giving a, a type of like a thing like you have to do you have to complete it take your project uh, it can be a science based project it can be your college time table it can be a recent developer project you actually made okay are you talking about my specialization uh, rpj if you are talking about that i am a front end developer i like to make front end technologies and i have a good proficiency in react too apart from that i love organizing events okay so i am a hackathon organizing too a good hackathon organizer in such days you find less them but you find all of them good at mlh okay so as i have said take your one project you have made in your 10th or recently i'll work around the website i recently made using an api based on crypto so i'll work around that and you have to do this activity we'll do this activity like we'll have different kanban boards and i'll try to share each and every one of that into the stream if you complete it uh, before like it's 11 12 uh, ist oh that's great yoke that's great that's great i'm also a front end developer so we will catch up soon uh thanks rpj okay so that's the thing i'll share each and every kanban board on the stream if you are making one uh take 10 minutes of time from now i am also going to make one same on the live stream like i have actually done uh, similarly like i made a website like the last month so i am going to put out all the elements in this kanban board you take your project you complete it you're going to share it in i'll just check the discord you can go and share your uh just give me a second you can go and share it in the channel the gsw september share hacks before 11:50 right i'll also share the channel name just give me a second hmm okay it's it's named uh, was my screen visible discord no okay so the channel name is uh, gsw share your hack it's it's visible in the discord so i'm giving you a part of total 10 minutes from now i am going to do the same thing on the stream you are going to pick your own project again i said it can also be you going to play a cricket match tomorrow like the things you will plan you will things actually list out the things i am focusing towards like uh, making a website or like an android project because we more like to build something like we all hackers like to build around projects and something and when we do that if we have that good proficiency we can do i guess if the channel link is correct thank you so much h14k uh, for sharing that 
I, as I said, you have 10 minutes from now. I'm also starting. Let's finish it by 11.25. And in the last five minutes, I'll actually share each and every one of them. So all the best. Let's start it. And if you have any doubts, you can, again, uh, ask in the uh, stream. And I also asked Mary and Brian to actually feature all of this in the tomorrow stream. So make sure you're putting your all efforts so that even when tomorrow all the hackers, how to edit in a Kanban board. So if you have logged into Trello RPJ, you will see an option here, right? So you can actually go and like just write uh, your website, like what you're creating. I'll write crypto website and okay. Uh, okay, I guess there is a thing with this. I have one more Kanban board with me. Are you guys facing the same problem with this? Just let me know in the chat if there is a problem with this because I guess there is a problem. Okay, I have this one. Great, great, great. I'll just share this one. You can actually do one more thing. You can create not just using a Kanban board. You can also do one thing. You can create a simple uh, board like it, it does, should not contain all these things. But I'll just, just check. Okay. I guess it's my own ID. So it's taking a lot more time. Okay. If you can actually see my screen, the workspace has reached the maximum number of boards. Okay. I need to check my workspace. Hmm. An e-commerce website. I guess you can get the option there to actually edit those things can you repeat one thing sure sure Sushmita, Sushmita, you can uh, choose that button okay actually uh the thing is like i have i have maxed out the number of kanban boards i can use in the free version but if like you can be you must be getting an option here somewhere here like create a kanban board if you have like just yeah, you have said that you made a new account right so for the new accounts, they give 10 up to 10 Kanban boards. So you can do that. Okay. If, if you got that, I can get an high in the chat. Just create on that button. It will ask you to actually make edit your template name. For example, I have made it into the name of e-commerce website here. Yeah? Okay. Uh, not this one, this one. So I can like start working on this. Hey, can I, can I head over to notion? Okay. As I have said, the most you're comfortable with anything. I would be happy to appreciate actually if you're uh, submitting your uh, Kanban board in front of me. You can use GitHub, you can use Notion. So Shmita, you can also use Notion uh, for making uh, the Kanban board. The template is also available there. Also, if you like, don't find it on Notion and also at Trello, just write Kanban board at the internet. It will actually take you somewhere like for the Kanban tablet. Uh, I can actually do that thing for you. Just give me a second. Kanban board. And also, do you use Canva? Shushmita, do you use a Canva? I'm using a phone. I can't do two things at a time. Okay. Uh, okay, Yosha, do one thing for me. Okay. Uh, I'm good with Trello. That's, that's great. Okay. So I have to focus on the class now. Okay, Yosha, can you do one thing for me? The things you're going to write in the Kanban board, just write it down in the paper, right? Like take a square paper, divide it into different sections. If you are like focusing on a website. So after that, you can write all those things we are you, which you are actually going to write in the Kanban board and share that photo in that channel. That will be great. That will do thing at max. Okay, Sushmita, so I'll once again say like, if you are comfortable with Trello or Canva, you can even you can go to Canva and search the Canva board. You'll find it. Not gonna lie. You're gonna find it. So I guess I'm already running late. I have already already have like, like only seven minutes to complete. We will uh, take entries from 11. Uh, we can extend it up to 1130. Once again, I'll say I'll specially request Mary and Ryan to take up all those Kanban boards we make yesterday and share it with all the hackers, which will be actually presented into the tomorrow's stream. It will be a special one because it would be the second last day for the Global Hack Week, September 2022 edition. So I guess a lot of people might get inspired from your Kanban board. 
how have you have actually done things once again you can take 10 minutes from here i'm also building the same on my system uh, for a crypto website and you can do the same for you so uh just start so i also talk about like uh, i have also made in canvan what's backlog here okay <laughs> once again uh, it's uh don't worry about the design thing you're sure just do one thing use your pen or pencil make a box like this for example if design is written right just make a box make a column and write the things in it for example if you're working on a website just write design write all the components under it which will you will actually focus on while designing your website and that will be it the main focus of canvan mode is to actually get structured while you are doing something again shushmita backlog here is just a channel like if you, like uh, when we certain things are actually should be done in a particular time and they're not completed, we treat it like as a backlog, right? For example, uh, if I have to communicate with uh, MLS people today and I fail to communicate with them, so that would be uh, like, uh, can be thought of as like a backlog thing. So you can put it out there. For example, when I was uh, designing my crypto website, I gave a name to myself like, for the first one month, I'm going to learn about how I can use React Router DMs, DOMs to actually navigate through the APIs but I failed to do that and I actually completed it in around 1.5 months. So for that extra 15 periods of time, I actually put it into a backlog kind of thing. Like the thing was actually not uh, completed in due time. So you can mention here, as I said, I'll also mention all the things I have, I have done during my e-commerce website. So for the design thing, I talked people. Like crypto or oh. user interface. Okay. I'll just say this. This is the things I have actually done while designing the uh, things. I browsed to multiple websites. To see how they work it should not be something like you have to mention each and everything just try to focus it like what are the key components you have actually seen in those things okay that would be the main focus mm, the next thing would be okay two things okay to do so when i actually started making this website the things i actually put it in my to-do list was actually to learn react so this was the earlier times i was actually learning react so learn react was the first thing learn about apis uh, learn about apis then when i was actually building the website i learned about i learned so it will be again learn because it's something which was in my to-do list learn so okay when i'm designing this uh, canman board i'm taking about a particular time where I was actually learning this thing and I was doing the same thing. So I was learning about Figma. Okay, so this was the things in the design, then this was the to-do thing. Then we like, what are the things I have actually done during that time? So I've done the research. I've done the research and again, uh, Accuracy, I've, I've actually worked on mathematical formulas or analysis because uh, when, when you talk about someone like me, I totally love maths. So that's a thing. So I was like, when I was working for the crypto website, I actually worked on the mathematical formulas, formulas which will actually, which actually helped me for like the analysis part. Okay. So I'll add this as a card and uh, the things were actually i was doing like while making those website was to learn css learn to implement css better okay so this was the thing again 
uh, when we talk about things like to do design and doing so when we talk about things like code review okay i'll just delete this one this is not necessary here just a second So when we talk about things like code review and something, code review is something which actually comes into the later part when you are designing a website. So for example, you have actually coded some part. Uh, I'll also show the website which I actually made. So it will help you guys to actually navigate through what I, what I am actually trying to tell. Uh, just give me a second. VS Code. The thing is, when we talk about things like code review and something, code review comes a into a later part of the stage. So I guess if you are a college student, you might be available about seven different things. That is the SDLC phases, the software development life cycle. I guess this is the, this is something every computer science or an IT engineer have might read or written n number of times. It can. So when we talk about those seven stages, these are like planning stage. Then we talk about the analysis, design development, testing, integration, and the maintenance. So I'm not going to go into something theoretical, but I'm just trying to make a focus on something like how the things are actually planned for, for a developer to actually work on a particular website. Okay. So I'll just also share my website. Okay. Uh, just a reminder, we have three more minutes until you finish your Kanban boards. We'll, we'll share that in stream soon. Okay, the website is almost up. I'll just wait for you guys. In the meantime, I'll complete my Kanban board. Just give me a second. I guess my reactive is actually working on the back end too. Okay. 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 I have done it. Click on the three dots and just archive it. How can I delete a card? Okay. I guess RPG helped you. I can't send pictures. Yes. No, you can uh, like in, you can can't send in the chat, but you can actually share it in the, I guess Harshit has uh, shared it. Uh, great work. Okay. It's Harshit. That's one four K great work. First of all, okay. We have. Mm, we have actually a dice game. Okay, RPJ. I'll actually uh, take up all the Trello links and I'll show it on the stream right, right now. Okay, you have done Friday the virtual assistance for Linux and Windows. Okay, we have two submissions right now, guys. We have two more minutes before we move on. Uh, UK, uh, Victoria, you can actually send it to the Discord. Uh, like, share your hacks. The channel name is GitHub Field of September. Share your hacks. You can just share that. Uh, uh, sh uh, Shizu, other can you actually help me? Uh, I can actually, I cannot actually open the comments from here. 
if you can actually share that in the share hacks oh rpj is good enough he actually shared it the photo version too thanks bro uh shushmita and shiju i'll once again ask you to guys to share it in the discord channel of uh if i can actually copy the link from here harshit can you help me with this uh, just share the link for the discord uh channel of that uh, github uh, gsw sorry i'm talking about github gsw september share hacks so that people can actually share the other thing is like i want to open it but uh, i okay thanks thanks harshit okay shashmita i received your save image i'll make sure i show each and every one of yours work and i'll also ask mary to do it we have also our work submitted from okay api world project great i'll also uh, i'll just do one thing before uh, we have two more minutes before a submission i guess shitesh has hasn't done it till now uh we will wait for him others are okay shijuka okay. i'm really sorry if i'm taking your names wrong i'm just pretty much confused with that uh i guess you have sent wrong link uh uh shizu kyotar i'm i'm really sorry if i'm confusing with your name but still mm okay ritesh has done ritesh can you please share it in the uh, local hack day uh, like the gsw channel for the share hacks i'll open it right from there till the time i'll open for harshit i just downloaded his um open with yeah i love that's great also i guess you guys are really good like actually submitting projects in due time uh, i'll talk about myself uh, when when we when i actually worked on things like canman mode or something i actually take a lot of time because but you guys have actually i have seen this okay before we work uh, move on i'll also share my small website i made recently using react uh, that would be the react app so uh, the thing the template i made the canvan board was for this website i made recently so this website again focuses on cryptos like their normal 24 hour and it uses the mathematical calculations for actually creating like the like the last one year analysis you can actually go and browse through it and it was a simple website it was like a small project made for my college so it was good it was good okay i'll start sharing screens i guess the projects are almost here ritesh has also done it ritesh thank you so much for mentioning when i can one session thank you i'll share my screen if i can if i can share my entire screen okay hmm okay we have to okay uh, harshit can you help me with one more thing can you share your link to your trello so that i can actually open all of those in uh the like the uh, chrome we have four open with me right now continue to the external link okay it's an ocean one right great nice one throw back to j days okay uh, ritesh i can feel you to be very honest <laughs> i can actually feel you uh please uh, harshit please share that in the uh, chat for the discord chat uh, the github field day one you can share a picture like harshit has just shared a picture uh, rpj has shared his picture of him doing the canvan session harshit great i was actually waiting for you one because i wanted to start with you before we move forward uh, this board is private i have just sent you a request please accept it i want to start with you you have done it for the first you can uh, victoria you can actually share it on um, discord guys have actually done it the one you actually uh, shared right now uh, ritesh it's i'm i'm actually going to talk about it because it's something which actually each and every uh, hacker should know that how colors can actually influence you on a large basis so i'll just share my screen 
I'll share the whole screen. So let let it be. If there would be a problem, we will actually work on. So uh, if you can see this Kanban board, you can actually see the color game. So when we talk about when we mention something in progress, when we are mentioning something at hold, then something at done. When you talk about the color strategy, if when when like you are entering into your Kanban board, you are something in green. So your mind will actually recognize it, it into the one sense like, yes, the work has been already completed. When we talk about something in red, for example, when you're uh, when we're in a railway, uh, like we're in crossing or something, we are in traffic. When we see red, we usually stop, right? So when we see red here, we can actually mention that this work is actually not completed. So great work, like in this one too. Uh, I'll share rest of the other works. Yes, uh, the board is not public for uh, uh, Harshit, and I so want to start with him. Okay, by the time I actually need to start with other people because we might be running late on the session too. Uh, we'll start with API World Project. This is made by, uh, just a second, I guess it's made by, um, it's made by Sushmita, if I'm not wrong. Start with mine, it's late. I'm really sorry. I guess it's your project, right, Sushmita? The API World Project. Great. So when we talk about she worked on, Okay, the backlog thing make my React skills stronger. Uh, design the UI with Figma. Okay, great. When we talk about the to do list you actually made for this, it's like Summit Kanban board on their post as an MLA challenge. Fix and meeting with Edit Hash to discuss about the project, divide the team, categorize APIs, learn Rust to go and implement. So I guess if someone is like particularly comfortable with Trello, you can actually see, you can go and actually drag it to done once you're done. So it actually helps you like you have completed a work and it's a great feel at the end. Okay, the next thing is uh, doing, making a GitHub repo. <laughs> we all, we all, because when we are actually working on projects, we usually make GitHub repos when we are done with code. We are so wrong in that, but this is a thing like when you are actually uh, working on a project, start with making a GitHub repo at first so that you can actually update your work time to time. As we can see, the shared work is shared GitHub repo with Eldrash. Also, the same thing here when, when we talk about the color strategy. Here you can mention, see, the to-do list is in the red market and the done is in the green market. You can actually easily see that the thing is done just for you. And, and I have just started working. Oh, it's your upcoming project. That's great. So that's the thing. Like when you are actually seeing this color, your brain actually focuses their attention towards those particular colors and the things written on, inside it and that is how it works so i guess a great one i'll ask if that can be shared tomorrow uh okay we have harshit's trello permissions are updated dice game i'm i'm so able to see it now we'll move to harshit one then ritesh uh okay you have harshit has made a dice game okay so backlog is deciding how the final project should be function okay deciding the tech stacks design and research making a wireframe or a blueprint online okay wireframe is something i, I guess each and every one of you are aware of like your website how it will look the to-do list consists of code html css bootstrap javascript currently what you're doing is coding the html part adding css okay so it's your current current project right Harshit? as I can actually mention. Shushmita Dev, thank you so much for actually sticking by the stream for so long. I know Kanban board is something like uh, everyone knows, like it's a daily routine, but still, thank you a lot. Have a good sleep. We'll catch up at a different session. We are just, we'll complete the stream looking at everyone's Kanban board. Okay, currently you're doing the HTML part, adding CSS, code review, save the project in view and browser, okay using JS to make it interactive and testing the final changes. So I guess that's a pretty good update from Harsh's side too. I made my first Kanban board. It feels very good to hear that. Thank you, Sushmita, once again for joining the stream and also sticking by till the end. Okay, we are done with Harshit. Harshit has done a great work too. We'll now move to Ritesh. Okay, I'll share my whole screen. The thing is the StreamYard link will actually get shared. So I'm pretty much okay now we'll move to ritesh uh so ritesh has worked around friday the virtual assistant for linux windows 
backlog reducing the execution time making an awesome year awesome cool guy okay so ritesh that would be one suggestion from, from my side you can actually focus this like a uh, cool ui in the design part you can actually frame it and once that design is completed you can actually like totally share it to into your done part in the to do part learning about api canvas canvas is a great tool not gonna lie doing want to deploy it in a web i guess that would be on my uh, to do list too thank you ritesh totally like i have made several projects but okay that's not me i use notion not taylor okay whose project it is if i am wrong uh i am really sorry whose project it was okay it's rpgs i guess i am really sorry okay 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 so all the credit i give to ritesh should shift it to rpg for now uh so the next thing we were actually discussing in want to deploy it in web so true i have made tons of project rpg and i haven't deployed a single one so i am really unha unhappy from my side too so currently you are do what you are doing is working on sending emails and whatsapp messages truly through voice okay now talking about the testing part testing the app on linux windows and removing error so you are comfortable with linux or uh, windows rpg like working on which uh, thing which actually helps you like it's easy for you uh, linux or windows rpg i am assuming it's linux the way you have mentioned it canvas has made a lot of tasks so much easier now i don't have to open photoshop for everything totally true arshit because uh, when even you talk about different type of posters we actually make for ourselves or for our community or any other organizations it is like it's an easier but don't know how to do it i'll i agree with you okay we'll actually uh, complete it fast we'll we have done the api project one i guess no we have we haven't done this this is also remaining linux is the main part for me i why when i was actually going through a kanban mode i was actually able to realize that hmm okay so the api project was actually sent by i'll probably be fixing uh the api project one is submitted by whom can i know that guys uh i don't know it's i guess it was done by uh uh, uh i am no forget sushmita and we have done this right so we can actually move on to the next session i so want to get on to ritesh uh ha huh, sushmita oh i i thought you left sushmita yes 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 we covered your part okay we'll move to ritesh <laughs> yes okay ritesh it's i am finding it difficult to use tola as i have again mentioned uh, victoria thank you sushmita was checking by so when we talk about hello specifically victoria you can actually go to canva or i was submitting on dev post oh great actually submitted i guess that might be a challenge too if like submitting a sessions like your kanban board if it's there so uh, if you're finding it difficult i just left the class to do it uh, if you are finding it difficult to use trello as i've said i i mentioned you thing like you can write it on paper and actually submit it in on the discord that would be a cool app. it looks better in dark mode do you want a pick can i actually do it actually this things looks good in dark mode the thing i am afraiding is the uh, what we say mm, the system thing okay just a second it is give me a second okay it is we will move on to the dark mode but we'll go through your canman board once again okay throw back to the jd days i guess me and ritesh uh, faces uh, like we have the same thing differential equations area under the curve aod worksheet integral worksheet differential equations i guess we share a lot in common ritesh in progress intro to indefinite integrals how to define definite integrals applications of differentiation limits and continuity differentiate okay so again i guess ritesh has actually given a perfect example of like how you are actually dividing things into different he has clearly mentioned what he has done in the past what is in the progress what's in the hold and what he has done so i guess this is a perfect example for uh, like the kanban board once again 
love for maths yes ritesh i also love maths but uh, i guess maths doesn't love me we i often used to study a lot for maths but uh, in the end i was not able to get a good score still a decent a decent student in the school <laughs> same here rpj once again uh, uh, ritesh make sure you actually i'll i'll help with uh, help for that uh, harshit don't worry uh, the they post one if we are having a challenge uh pritesh uh, also do one thing make sure all the people who have uh, spammed their link in the share your hacks you also share your screenshot so that it would be easy for us to actually take it up for the tomorrow stream uh okay so who we are left currently do we have done this okay we have done this we have done the e-commerce website okay we have done for okay if i can actually share discord for a second just give me a second i'll just share the discord and i'll this i'm actually super happy today because uh the way you guys have actually participated in like i'm very proud of you guys like we don't have a good crowd here but the type of audience you are is been absolutely great okay i guess i am not i am probably flexing at this point but a lot of people might find this useful will power is something i guess once again the color game guys you can actually work on the color game you can see how actually he has divided will investment portfolio okay learn japanese learn java development kunal okay i guess it's kunal gushwa if i'm not wrong do dsa every day i guess you can also see the small category categories which are mentioned inside this for example i'm really sorry when we talk about learn japanese brain habit and collab exercise six times a week uh, i'm with you on that uh, wake up on time uh, i'm really sorry <laughs> again sleep on time i get it's already 12 here so i'm really sorry i'm taking it too long test typing working on back end boot.dev uh, then we have work on the web development odin okay sushmita shared her kanban board ritesh i guess then rpj also shared his i guess you guys have done it perfectly the more i could have actually expected and i guess uh, harshit shared harshit started the initiation and all just look forward so that's it uh okay sure i'll make sure if you have actually completed a kanban session after this uh session you can actually share it in the github field day uh again i'm really sorry in the global hack week channel like for the share hacks and i'll make sure all of these gets mentioned in tomorrow's stream is he still in mlh yes he's a coach at mlh kunal kushwa you might not seen in the streams but he is working on the back end part so yep it's a thing once again i wanted to share a big thanks to all of the people and especially ritesh sushmita then we have rpj harshit thanks for submitting the hacks guys and also victoria i guess she or he is having some problems with the session like not been able to but thank you so much for submitting your tasks i guess you might be able to get some insights from the today's session again kanban board is something we were actually doing from our childhood times but when we talk about developer things like when we talk about working into an industry this is how it was work harshit it was not it was not a great session but it was a great audience to be very honest and i'm very happy you guys sticked throughout the session like literally throughout the session the activity which i have seen from you guys has been super great and the, and the energy you actually you guys actually provided through the submissions was like totally great so once again thank you so much for joining by make sure if you have submitted the kanban board you like you can actually submit it into git uh, in global hack week september share hacks and i'll make sure mary share it in tomorrow's stream until then i'll take a bye and it would be thank you from my side and if you are based in india good night we'll see you in another session bye guys take care and again again one more thing one more thing uh, i guess i'm missing it uh uh actually mary reminded me of something make sure you have actually checked into into the event like if we, even if you are in the chat uh i'll just share the link if you haven't checked in for the event for this particular event i should have done this thing in the starting but again uh, it's all okay thank you so much harshit thank you so much rpj ritesh uh, uh sushmita victoria Thank you all of you guys for sticking by and I'll see you guys in the next session till then take care good night